Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Gay Let's Play Dragon Age Inquisition. In our last episode, it was pure awesome sauce, at least for me, when we were <laughs> essentially getting a little jiggy with, with Colin. To my surprise, we were allowed to do that. So, I don't know if I necessarily need to grab all of these elf roots around here, but... Um, so I am going to... Can I not bring my party? Can I not bring my party with me out to the wilderness? Well, well I'll see. I don't want to have to... Yeah, I don't want to deplete all the elf root in the whole area, but... We'll see. Um... Where's my... I don't got my journal. I want to do... Uh, passing notes. Yeah. Find Tegan's notes. So... I guess there's no more demons, so there's no one else who can, you know... There's no... I guess I don't need my group with me, because there's no demons? Uh oh. How do I get up? How do I get over there? Did I just mess myself up? Oh. Alright, I need to get over there. Um, this way. Find Tegan's notes. So... Climb this way? Oh, come on. Art. Come on, Art. You are Kanari. Okay. You're supposed to be pretty darn tall. Okay, go this way. Okay. I guess I'll go this way then. Oh, this is a lot. Huge maps for me to explore. The, they weren't kidding. Um, the developers weren't kidding when they said that there was a lot of things. I'm gonna do my best to search everywhere. When the compass pulses, press B to search. When the compass pulses. Searching indicates the direction of hidden objects with an additional pulse on the ground, and if you're close enough, reveals them. So there might be something here. Better take a closer look. Oh. Okay, this is different. Whoa. Examine. What is this? Oh, return the notes to Dan. Oh, very cool. Okay, cool. All right. Nice. Requisition for weapons. So I need that. Haven. Requisition for weapons. Okay. Um, is there anything else in here? I guess not. So it's a good thing it wasn't. Right, it's this thing. It's a good thing that he wasn't in the conclave when that blew up, because otherwise I don't know if those notes would still be there. So. Still a lot of things for me to uproot, apparently. Captain Planet would have a fit. Ooh. Iron. I will take this. More things to craft. Thank you very much. Wow, there's a lot of iron deposits here. We are doing awesomely. Beautiful, beautiful. There's stuff here. Okay. Oh, there's still more stuff. Sheesh, there's a lot of stuff. We're going to need to be crafting weapons. A little, ooh, times three. Beautiful. Look around for other things. Ooh. There we go. More elf fruit. Yeah, I mean, I'm going to try my best to find as many things as I can, guys, but I'm not going to promise that I'll be able to find every single thing. 
is that coming from? Does my compass tell me? Oh. It's this thing. More elf fruit. Ooh, it's a nug! <gasps> it's a nug! What are nugs doing up? I, I thought nugs were in the deep roads. What are they doing out here? Hey, come on. I don't know if I want to kill it, though. I don't know if I want to kill it, though. Yeah, I guess you can get crafting items for nugs, but I, I don't want to hurt them. They're too cute. Wow, there's sure a lot of stuff to explore around here. Still no sign of the um, royal elf fruit. If it would be nice if the map had like a fog of war to show the areas that I haven't been to, just so it's easier for me to navigate and to, you know, so I don't keep double backing. Might as I... well turn around. Really? Are you talking to yourself? Are you talking to yourself? No, Art. Oh. Ooh. Quest 1, requisition for weapons. Oh, this is the world map. Interesting. Um, but I don't want to... I don't want to leave. The hinterland, seeing red. Varric saw enough red larium in Kirkwall for one lifetime. It's it, and and now it's everywhere. And the worst of it sings like the shard that drove his brother mad. Varric would take no small pleasure in destroying those. Locate and destroy primeval red larium. Okay. Hmm. So that might be a good mission for us to go to at some point. World map. Okay. Hmm. Um. There we go. More of these elf roots. More of these elf roots. Still no sign of the royal root. Let's upgrade. If we kind of see everything there is to see. I don't see where this thing is. Oh, there it is. Iron. Lots of stuff. I'm wondering how much I can, how much inventory sp space I have for these things. You know, should I just use it or lose it? Elf root. Requisition for weapons, requisition for weapons. More elf fruit. A learned child is a blessing upon his parents and onto the maker. Alright, I need to go there. Which means I probably need to take the bridge over this way. Oh wow, that rift is still up there. Wee! Don't mind me, folks. I'm just taking a stroll. Looks like there's the seeker headquarters there. I don't see where that. Where am I? Where do I want to go? Don't see. Oh, the elf fruit. There we go. I'm like all that fuss for another elf fruit. There's something close here. More nugs. 
I, I always thought nugs were native to the deep roads, but apparently not. Yeah, there's the thing I was finding. Iron. Elf root. More iron. Anything else over here? No. Okay. I got some more iron back over here. Yep. Thank you. Hmm. More iron over here. Wow. Got a good amount of iron. Still no sign. Royal. Keep a close eye, because I would love to upgrade my potions if I can. Although I don't know if Royal Root you can even get in this area. Something. Oh, read. The Penitence Crossing. Pilgrims seeking to visit the Temple of Sacred Ashes are allowed to ride as far as the bridge known as Penitence Crossing. Then, whether they may be, they be sick or healthy, young or aged, the pilgrims are expected to walk by the temple's sisters who supervise the bridge. All but the very sick and old are asked to shed heavy coats as they cross the bridge, allowing the cutting winds to strip prideful fixation upon this world from the flesh. The bridge is also of significant military value, used especially for these purposes in the years since the Fifth Light. As a checkpoint against bandits, rebels, or even darkspawn stragglers, the bridge serves as a defensible fortification to protect the Temple of Sacred Ashes from threats. From the walking from walking the chant by Sister Dorcas Guerin. That kinda reminds me of the Penitent Man Shall Pass um, thing in Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade. Um what do we have here? Ooh, spindleweed. Cool. And money from this poor Poor mage. Okay. Oh, wow. We've gotten farther than I thought. So we're not in Haven, we're in the Frost. Now this is where the, the war, whatever, the fog of war kicks in. Okay. Whoa! If you leave the bounds of an area or enter somewhere lethal, you'll be jumped back to... Oh. So apparently I'm not allowed to go that way. Okay. Whoops. Alright. It's hard for me to tell, though, what was the boundaries there. Am I gonna... Ooh, that's a, that's a far drop. Oh, I'm going to so die now. Okay, no, I'm not dead yet. Whoa! Okay. Took some damage. That probably wasn't a good plan. Ooh! Oh, can I hunt? For fur? And for meat? Oh, jeez. I'm Kanari. So I guess this lets me hunt for something. What do we have here? Ram leather. Oh, cool. Okay. Yeah, I think this is where we want to go. Alright, so we can get more resources that way. Logging stand. Logging stand. Oh, poor Ram thing. I don't think that Art is beneath, you know, hunting when he needs it for food and for resources. I don't think he's... Angelus would probably not be a big fan. He's a little bit more of a tree hugger. But I don't think Art is a Druffalo. I don't think he's going to attack me. Oh, boy. 
Oh my gosh. Shocked. Give myself a little bit of it. Uh oh. Maybe this wasn't a good idea. This probably wasn't a good idea. Whoa! Yeah, this wasn't a good idea. Uh oh, oh my gosh. Yeah, this wasn't a good idea. Retreat, retreat. I bit off a little bit more than I could chew. Oh my gosh. Ooh, okay. Alright, note to self. I also have potions. I should remember that. Druffalo hide. Maybe I should have taken a potion. <laughs> Alright. Where's... I, I, maybe there was a way to bring my party with me, and I just don't know. Can I bring my party with me? Alright, I guess I'll find out later. I don't know if I want to ta tackle with a Druffalo at this moment. Probably not worth it this at right. There's only yeah. I don't want to kill off the entire, you know, herd of them. Well, there's another one here, so it's not like I'm killing them all. Um. Barrier. Yes. There we go. Not too bad. All right. Oh, I didn't even. Oh, there wasn't even any. I wasn't even able to get hide from that. Oh well. Where is the thing ring ring me for? Oh, it's just yeah, it's just the elf root. Okay. Requisitions for weapons, no. Oops, yeah, I'm not gonna bother with two of them. Druffalo. Don't bother Druffalo. Hopefully I didn't actually hurt any of your friends. Just trying to forage. Would've been nice if I got some meat out of that too, you know, so I felt like it wasn't wasting the entire Druffalo. I'm sure Druffalo burgers would've been awesome. Ooh, we're almost there. So many trees. Totally missing some things. Oh, is this where the logs are? Ooh, call, claim logging stand. Ooh, I claim this in the name of the Inquisition. Nice, where's the logging, logging site located? Cool, I guess we can come back here and get... Awesome. Get what we could need to make provisions for the Inquisition. Provisions for the Inquisition. Come on. Come on. There you go. And here. Right. Before I go down that bridge, I just want to make sure there's nothing else here. More iron. More iron. And more iron. Okay. And there's wait there's a lot of iron. I'm gonna have to sell some of these things or something. Convert them into stuff. 
Sheesh, there's a lot of things. All the things. I'm gonna take them all. Hopefully they'll replenish. Okay. And more elf fruit, but no royal elf fruit to be found. What's over here? Oh! How did I not- how did I miss this? Was this? Oh, is this the house where we were- uh, Yes, this is the house where I was. I was- I could have gone- Well, I wanted to go all- turn around anyway. I wanted to explore. Alright, so let's go ahead and, um... Inquisition soldiers. Yeah, let's go ahead and, um... Go back to the war room, because I wanted to check something else before. Um, hey, Colin, bye, Colin. I got stuff to do for the Inquisition. Um, here we go. Right up here, and... I think we got what we need. Thren. Can I help you with something? Um. If I have material for a special order, do I bring it to you? Just take it over there. One of my boys will take the materials or jot down what you found. All right. Farewell. Make a go with you. Yep. All right. Here we go. So you I... dislike the Templar sister? No. I know their purpose, but you remember I once ministered in a circle chantry. Yes, I assumed you were used to having Templars around, keeping us safe from the mages. The mages in the circle followed the chant of light as faithfully as the Templars, sister. More faithfully than some Templars, even. Some of the things those Templars did when they thought I did not see. Okay, um... Inquisition weapons! Required logging stand. Heck yes. And iron. We got a lot of iron. You have crafted Inquisition weapons. Your, our soldiers require additional weapons if they're to be effective. Reward one power. Heck yes. Yes. Influence. The threat remains. Travel to. Whoa, nice. Quest completed. Requisition for weapons. Nice. We have more power. World map. So I do want to go to. I do want to help Varric as well before I go into the main quest. But let's go to the war room. I want to save real quick. Let me save a new game. One life, one death. Summon the War Council. Want to try out some things. Alright, folks. Um, we have one power. Contact the Valo Cas Mercenaries. Has Cassandra spoken to you about my new recruits? They are not your recruits, Commander. They're ours. <laughs> Snap, she told you, Culls. All right, contact the Velocost mercenaries. I believe this is our mercenary group, so contacting me might be good. Adar, I heard you were dead, and then a prisoner, and then maybe you fell out of the fade and landed on your head and forgot who you were. Seriously, stop that. We still haven't been paid. Oh, some of our kith made it out of that giant hole full of demons after the explosion. The rest are dead or missing. I don't know how many were rounded up by angry humans. If you're not dead and you remember who you are, help me find our brothers and sisters. Shakrakar. If you forgot who you are, I'll remind you. Your name is Adar. You're Vashaw. You didn't get paid for being blown up. PPS. If you are dead, disregard this message. <laughs> Requires 12 minutes. Oh. Okay. I don't know if that's in-game or out-of-game, but... 
We'll give this Let's a try. Let's see what we have. No, oh, I didn't want to necessarily use Liliana. Let me go back. Let me go back. Messed up there. Okay, let's try that again. Cause I I would I wanted to read. I was didn't choose I didn't mean to choose it. Sheesh, come on now. What have your ears heard, Leliana? Anything new we don't already know about? No. Nothing. So let's see the different ways that we can handle this. Laliana, many Talvashoth were likely captured in prison after the Conclave. Our agents could free them. That would be good. The nobles are likely keeping Kanari from crossing their lands. We can negotiate passage. Oh. Cullen, we can send a patrol to find the scattered Talvashoth mercenaries in the wilderness. Interesting. Um, oh, so it, depending on how much time... 15 minutes, 12 minutes for Leliana and Cullen. We can send a patrol to find the scattered Talvashoth mercenaries in the wilderness. Many Talvashoth are likely captured in prison after the conclave. Our agents could free them. The nobles are likely keeping Canari from the cost of their plans. We can negotiate passage. Let me take a look at some of the other ones. Hi, hard in Hightown. Ruffles. I need a favor. Actually, let's call it a loan. Since I'll pay it back, I got a letter from my editor in Kirkwall today. She tells me that hard in Hightown, the repunctioning appeared in print from an, Antivan, from an Antivan printer a couple weeks ago. I'll give you a moment to contemplate the horror that is that title. I had my contacts in the Merchant's Guild look for the author a couple years back. The best they could find out after spending a couple hundred gold was that Pyrol Bellenforth is, is a pen name. I could have told them that for free. You've got contacts with the Antivan print house. Maybe you could find out more than, than the guild. Liliana, if this author has evaded the Merchant's Guild, the Crows might be a better choice for investigating it. Hmm. Uh. I had my Merchant's Guild look for the author a couple of years ago. There's they could find out. Okay. Nope. Uh, not participating in this mission. I could ask a friend in the Tiva city to look at this matter, I suppose. I suppose. Um, I don't know, Josephine doesn't seem to have her heart set onto this one, so... I'll have Liliana do this one. Let's see what we have. Yeah, time remaining. Okay, okay, so it looks like it's in-game. Um, scout the Storm Coast, Terran of Hive River, address the nobleman's concerns. Completed the secret, scout the hinterlands. Gather coin. Up until now, Inquisition forces have had the benefit of the Chantry's deep coffers. Now the Inquisition is forced to seek out its own sources of revenue if it is going to grow any further. Trade in and out of Haven is limited at this point, but there are various opportunities to earn coin, provided the Inquisition is willing to focus its efforts on the matter. It would be a simple matter to collect secrets and sell them, with nothing traceable back to the Inquisition. We have soldiers. Let them protect caravans and do other honest work for coin. Trading in favors with merchants and their nobility is my specialty. It could earn us a great deal if we're careful. For ooh, Josephine. Wow. All right. I feel like Josephine. That's a good one for Josephine. That's right up her alley. Um. We need power eight. Address a nobleman's cause, Harold. Your inquisition says it's for order against chaos. Reason and darkness. If you stand by this, come forth and drive the heretics from my lands. They claim to be refugees, but I have seen elves and apostates among them, filthy savages, tearing at our roots. Our monarch refuses to send forth armies, and my own knights were decimated at the conclave. I require your aid to return peace to my lands. Prove your loyalty, and I will see you richly rewarded for your faith. Praise the light, Lord Kildren of Ferelden. 
We can take advantage of this raving. His raving. My spies can harness the refugees into moving somewhere else to win Lord Kildran's favor. We could send a few patrols, but I prefer they help the refugees, not this Lord Kildran. Yeah, I agree. Ah yes, Lord Kildran, a pariah even among his peers. Let us send a polite refusal and nothing more. Hmm. Not sure how I want to handle that. The Terran of High Ever. To whom it concerns, the Terran of High Ever wishes to convey our deepest sympathies on the death of Divine Justinia V. The Most Holy has was incomparable in her wisdom and dedication to peace, and we had high hopes that her conclave would succeed. We will hold a vigil in High Ever in remembrance of Justinia and cordially invite the Inquisition to attend. Sincerely, Terran Fergus Kuzland. Oh, Kuzland, Fergus. Fergus! Awesome. I know Terran Kuzland, and I knew Justinia. I can't attend, but I could write to him. Hmm. We have a number of Ferelden officers. We could send an honor guard to High Ever. We, would, we should send a diplomat attaché and some of the Templars who knew the Divine. This really is something for Liliana. I think we'll wait for Liliana to finish her duties and do this. Because that really makes the most sense. Um... Scout the hinterlands, address the nobleman's concerns. I think what I'll do is... We can send a patrol to find the scattered Talvashoth mercenaries in the wilderness. The nobles are likely keeping Canari from crossing their lands. We can negotiate passage. Um... Trying to think. This one I'm saving for no Liana. We could send a few patrols, but I would prefer. Colin doesn't really seem set on that. Pariah, let us send a polite refusal and nothing more. None of them is really particularly keen on working with that, but. We have soldiers, let them protect caravans and do other honest work for other coin. Our trading in favor with the merchant in the middle is my specialty. It could earn us a great deal if we're careful. That's her specialty though. Um here, this is what we'll do. Uh let's have Colin. Let's have Colin deal with the mercenaries. That seems like more up his alley. Cullen, you can deal with the mercenaries, my friend. We can send a patrol to f yeah. To work? Yep, yes sir. Sir, yes sir. And we'll have... This is her specialty. I have to give this one to... to, um, Josephine. Let us begin. Cool. Very cool. So, while that's cooking, um, I think when Kaliliana is done... Yeah, everybody's busy. When Liliana is done with with helping out Varric, I'll have her work with the Tavern of High Ever, and then we'll figure out what to do with the nobleman's concerns. Probably have um, uh, Josephine take care of that, is my guess. But we'll see. Thank you all. Cool. Alright guys, I think that's all I'm going to do for this session. Thank you again for watching this episode of Gay Let's Play Dragon Age Inquisition. Tune in next time everybody, and until then, love yourselves, and love each other.